Hello to all my luxury bad lovers and welcome to Taylor Chelsea. Here where we talk about luxury baths and other luxury items. This is a voiceover, which means I recorded the video and did the voiceover at a later time. If you have not already, please hit that like button, follow, and share. Today is what fits in my bag. This is the Louis Vuitton Odeon MM Monogram with the black leather. So, let's get into it, y'all. Now, as you can see here, it has a magnetic pocket. I could fit my whole hand in it. I generally carry my phone in there. I'm recording on my phone right now. I do have the iPhone 12. It has dual zipper pull. Oh, my God. The hardware on this bag is absolutely beautiful and that gold and that black looks amazing next to the monogram now here on the straps each end it does have louis vuitton as well it has the louis vuitton luggage tab with lv and gold it has the black leather tabs on it look here and then it does have black piping that goes from one side of the bag see here all the way to the other side i think it just really makes this bag look nice look at that <gasps> oh my god she's beautiful she's the showstopper this bag is a very good crossbody or shoulder bag here okay in the bag, I'm pulling out my planner. This is not a LV planner. This is a planner I bought off Etsy for $27. It is comparable to the LV um, planner GM. However, this planner is two inches bigger, one inch across and one, one inch for length and one inch for width bigger. I absolutely love it. I want the LV planner, but I never use the planner. So this is my trial run, y'all. I order it. If I use it for six months, I'm going to go ahead and come for the LV planner, baby. And can I just interject here that Louis Vuitton has restocked at the time of this recording. I ordered my bag Wednesday, 12 a.m. I had my bag Thursday. Here's my Gucci wallet, y'all. I'm pulling out. I'm sitting in next to it. Um, I also have my coin purse. I'm just trying to set everything neat so you can see what fits in my bag and my bag at the same time. This is that Louis Vuitton mini pochette. Oh, I'm so in love. And she's full to the match, y'all. And let's get back into it. And here, um, look like I emptied the mailbox. There's a couple of envelopes and a piece of paper. But this is my bag, y'all. All right. And here, where I'm at, is allergy season. And I'm fighting with the earth. And here is my medication. Okay. And I also have an inhaler. Just sit that to the side. Okay. This is a receipt I pulled out of my bag. I don't even know where it's from. All right. Now here, see, the bag appears to be empty, but it's a black slip pocket. I have a 12-pack pill in there. That slip pocket holds a little bit more. I generally carry my headphones in that pocket but I just don't happen to have them at the time of the recording but as you can see all this stuff that fits inside the bag this is a spacious bag so just wanted to show you now I'm putting everything back in the bag reminding you that that 12 pack of pills is already still in there okay I'm just placing everything back in the bag and again, I just compared it to the LV planner so that you have a, a idea of the size that I'm working with right here. But however, I'm going ahead and place this in the bag. I can't stand it straight up because it put tension on the zipper. It fits. Yeah, it fits standing up. However, it's tension. So here I turned it counterclockwise. And here, I'm just sit it back up and try to zip it. Well, I'm going to zip it. I'm just going to show you the tension. Try to see what you can get off the screen. However, I'm going to turn that back around. And I am laying things down kind of on this side, like straight up. See that? The Gucci wallet and the mini pochette. This is my catch-all for my bag, y'all. It's full of everything that don't want to float them out of my bag. I set that straight up. The coin purse is sitting straight up. My inhaler. Now, here is my nose sprays. I'm sitting them straight up. And this bag, again, 
it fits so much. I'm going to go ahead and zip her up. Now it's time to dress her up, y'all. I have absolutely, I changed the strap. Here again, I'm showing you my hand. Look at this strap. This strap is beautiful. It's leather. It's adjustable. It has the gold hardware. Louis Vuitton and stamp, but it don't work for me, y'all. It's not long enough. So I ordered me a strap off of Amazon. I ordered me a strap. I ordered me a charm. And I ordered me a chain for my purse. All under $40, y'all. This strap, I think it's 50 inches. It allows me to wear my bag as a crossbody. It also allowed me to wear it as a shoulder bag because, again, it is adjustable. And it does have the gold hardware on it. And so, this, it was well worth the money. I think this strap was maybe like $15, $15.99. So, anyway, again, all three items, $40 that I here, look at this charm. It's beautiful, y'all. $10 to $12. Beautiful. I am just dress up my bag. I put my own little stink, my own little swag on my bag, y'all. Here it is. Look. Ooh, it's noisy when it hit up against that canvas. And I love it, y'all. I get compliments on this bag no matter where I go. It's a conversation piece. It gets the conversation started. Okay, now I'm going to put this chain on here. It's black and gold. I thought it would go really good with the bag bring out the black and also bring out the gold and as you can see it y'all oh my god and it's noisy and i love it now you don't have to order something that's noisy but i love it look at her <gasps> look at her she's gorgeous thank you lewis for time creators all right y'all bye that's what fits in my bag